मुरम्मत यागी सीधे आपको ले चलते हैं राष्ट्रपति भवन जहां अंतर्राष्ट्रीय मीटिंग समिट में केंद्रीय सूचना प्रसारण मंत्री वेंकैया नायडू संबोधित कर रहे हैं It is important for the financial sector, especially public sector banks, to come forward and join hands with organizations like Bharat Yavasakti Trust to explore the entrepreneurial potential in our country. An equally important input is mentoring. It is very hard to be a successful entrepreneur without having a good mentor. It is essential to have, a, have someone you can look up to and emulate. Also, a mentor will show you the tricks and the pitfalls of the game because they have likely uh, they have likely already been around the block i understand that the bharati yavasakti trust program provides mentoring services through volunteer expert mentors to the startups entrepreneurs for starting up industries two, uh, two years after setup mentoring includes providing business development services training on financial discipline business plan development technical evaluation of the project arranging for necessary statutory licenses bank loan facilitation hand holding after take off business networking participation in trade fairs exhibitions and awards for business excellence government has been focusing on a new vision of self employment to bring about a change in mindset especially among youth the prime minister has given a program called as missy dc missy dc is the name given by me program is given by the prime minister What is this Miss CDC? MI Make in India, LI SI Skill India, DI Digital India, CI Clean India. That is Miss CDC. That is what is happening in the country. Various sectors are trying to do their best in taking this movement forward. Friends, the with the demographic changes taking place in our country, ours is an young India with 65 percent of the population being below 35 years of age. This is a challenge as well as an opportunity also. This aspiration India is looking. For, more for opportunities than entitlements the task before all of us is to create sufficient opportunities so that the large number of aspiring youth can express themselves in the form of productive activities which in turn can drive our economy on a higher growth path more than anybody else the prime minister sri narendra modi is particularly aware of the potential of young india their aspirations and potential that's why he is relentlessly focusing on creating the enabling entrepreneurship ecosystem so that the emerging and the new opportunities are converted into economic activities for the advancement of this of the uh, of the self and the country also as i told you friends uh, make in india digital india startup india stand up india earlier the startup and stand up we used to hear these things during our school days and you come late teacher used to say stand up Stand up on the bench. Now stand up on your own legs. Start up, incubation, innovation, new phraseology, new ideas, new thinking is happening in the country. That's the need of the hour. We must take it forward, friends. So the prime minister also has given emphasis on social security, not only skill development but also he focus is focusing his attention on social security, whether it is the jana dhana. the inclusiveness in the banking sector earlier we had a few bank accounts now we have 26.80 crore new bank accounts same people same bank bank employees no ot but everybody has been asked to do their duty and they have done their duty that's why this huge increase in bank accounts also from earlier 5 crores to 26.80 crores there is there is a sort of a confidence once you have a bank account secondly also stressed in the recent days the need for mudra bank mudra bank is giving loans to the entrepreneurs to the women he said 60% of the loans of the mudra bank should go to women because women they have skills and they also excel if an opportunity is given to them they will excel the only thing is you have to give them opportunity in our country it is high time that we should also encourage women in a big way in various fields including in politics of course mere reservation alone will not suffice but along with the reservation people has to think in terms of economic empowerment of women also if you give them proper education if there is saraswati then lakshmi will also automatically follow if the lakshmi is there there is no guarantee saraswati will come to lakshmi we have lakshmi ji here but at the same time she is trying to combine both lakshmi and parvati and our some people say no no this has been a system sir women has to be at home etc that's not correct If you go to Vedas and Upanishads and also the Puranas and the other other parampara, women always were given their due respect. 
you will take, take the name of the country, Bharata Mata, not Bharata Pita. We don't call India as Bharata Pita. We call it as Bharata Mata. And all the big rivers in the country, Mahanadi, Mahendra Tanaya, Narmada, Kaveri, Yamuna, Saraswati, Ganga, every river is named after Roman. And even the Puranas also tell you the earlier the education portfolio was held by Saraswati, the defense portfolio was held by Parvati, and the finance portfolio was held by Lakshmi, Lakshmi at that time. तो आप देख रहे हैं सीधा प्रसारण जहां अंतर्राष्ट्रीय मिंटरिंग समिट में केंद्रीय मंत्री वेंकैया नायडू अपना संबोधन दे रहे हैं जिन्होंने कहा है कि इस तरह के अवसरों को बदलने की जरूरत है अवसरों को पैदा करने की जरूरत है जो कि उत्पादकता में बदले जा सकें और युवाओं की उसमें जो प्रतिभागिता है वो ज्यादा से ज्यादा हो इसके अलावा उन्होंने ये भी कहा कि एक समग्र समावेशी सुरक्षात्मक चौतरफा वातावरण समाज में बनाने की जरूरत है जिससे कि जो नागरिक हैं उनमें एक आत्मविश्वास का भाव पैदा हो विशेषकर महिलाओं में और उनके आर्थिक सशक्तिकरण पर केंद्रीय मंत्री वेंकैया नायडू ने जोर दिया